Well, Postman Pat um, is Postman Pat we all know and love, and uh, he gets seduced by fame and goes into a singing competition. And um, then it, everyone wonders what on earth is going on with Postman Pat, and then you'll get quite a shock when he opens his mouth and starts to sing. <laughs> Well, of course, it, it, you know, all the stories are wonderful and they, they you know, are timeless. You can watch them at any time um, uh, throughout the years. But this one does bring it right up to date uh, with this, you know, reality TV sort of being seduced by fame, that sort of thing. So I think it's very, very relevant uh, to what's going on today. And can you tell us a bit about where your character fits into things? Yes, I play Sarah Clifton, his wife, and uh, we have a wonderful, fun, sweet relationship. But um, she does get a little bit worried that he's getting seduced by fame and that he's changing and not the pet that she knows and loves. Um, but you'll see, it's a real love story and, and she's his biggest fan. So, Why do you think he remains such an iconic and beloved children's figure? I think because it's such a sweet, wholesome, wonderful character that, um, that kids really relate to, you know? Um, and throughout the years, I think he's remained that and um, I think that he's a very appealing, charming, charming, sweet character that kids really do love. Of course, I mean, he's been given a bit of a facelift in this film, a new style of animation. Um, can you describe that and kind of what you think that's going to bring to a, a new audience, a younger audience? I think it will appeal to the younger audience because it is very, very now and um, I think kids will relate to that in a huge way and I think they'll enjoy, enjoy the, way it's, the way it's, you know. Of course, fans uh, will recognise a number of the voices. Can you talk a little bit about some of the other fantastic people lending their voice to the new Pat cast? Yeah, well, it's obviously David Tennant, Stephen Mangan, who plays Postman Pat, um, uh, Jim Broadbent, obviously, and Rupert Grint. Yeah. Of course, I mean, the voice of Pat is um, you know, very familiar to us all. I think we all have memories of it from our childhood. Um, how's Stephen's Pat? Um, how does that compare to what we uh, are sort of very familiar to hearing coming out of Pat's mouth? Oh, I think he's amazing. I think he's absolutely wonderful. And I think he is the, the Pat of this generation. He's just brilliant. Um, yeah, you'll be... He's so funny. And uh, Pat, Postman Pat himself, is so sweet and kind. And he just brings that out so much. Such a lovely, lovely guy. I mean, for you as a performer, how does the experience of voice acting compare to uh, on-screen work? Um, it's wonderful. It's really liberating. Um, it's such a creative process. You know, you can really uh, bring so much to, to the process because it's over such a long period of time. So the script is continually changing and, and uh, it's a really fun, creative, creative process. What's coming up for you next? Is there anything else on your plate at the moment? Um, I've just done a movie. Um, I, I, I can't remember if I mentioned I live in LA now, so I, I did a movie in LA um, that's due out later on this year called Branded. Can you tell us anything about that? Well, that's about where you fit into that one. It's a post-apocalyptic thriller, so very, very different. <laughs>